guess what I've got. <sighs> ah, it's been a long road, hasn't it, my Reptus? You've done so well. Everyone doubted your potential for selective assimilation. Everyone except for me, of course. We need only arouse the remaining mutation vectors and it will be complete. Imagine it. No host rejection. No secondary augmentations. Tonight, we finish it. Tonight, we conduct the final experiment. <laughs> Everything is arranged. Perhaps not as clinical as certified company equipment, but we make do. Our fates are intertwined now, my little ants. Do not fail me. We'll program a simple linear sequence to begin with. Electrode fire acid, then the laser. Don't be shy. You want the jelly, don't you? Look, a nice big blob on the surface. Come and get it. You haven't tasted this before, have you, my reptiles? Pure, concentrated jelly. None of the other specimens survived exposure, so you'll be the first. Unless my hypothesis is wrong, in which case your lethal neoplasms will spread through the colony. No one wants to see that. Charging the capacitors. Now don't be startled if you hear a slight pop. This noisy equipment must be quite intimidating. How about a familiar distraction? A handful of happy beetles will do nicely. Extinguisher on standby for this one. Safety first. Imagine while all this is going on if you had to share your terrarium with a collection of highly agitated spiders. Why, it would be absolute pandemonium. <laughs> Whoops! Acid is pressurized. The nozzle takes aim. The danger is clear. But the jelly is right here. Your move. <laughs> Look what I've done. You're melting. Melting. Oh, what a world. What a world. How about some bombardier beetles? Now that you've faced down a jet of noxious super acid, these should be child's play. The laser is charged to 20 watts. Don't look into the beam. Oof. 
perhaps a little too powerful, or not powerful enough. And that concludes the Warbuck test. How was that? Feeling limber? Stretched? Hungry for more? Good. Next, we'll observe the effects of simultaneous exposure to multiple stimulants, programming in a distributed sequence. There. Good luck. <laughs> Let's make the arena more interesting, shall we? What about the selection of angry mantises? That's interesting, isn't it? of adaptation has accelerated tenfold. the stimulation intensity should be increased. After all, our brave raptors have not gone this far to be coddled. They expect stringent test conditions. We'll start by increasing the electrode discharge capacity. the laser to 40 watts next. Oh, and it looks like you're running out of mantises. Let me help you with that. Exposure to three cycles of each stimulant complete. It would seem that full spectrum immunity has yet to develop. Do you know what that means, my little Oreptus? That's right, you're so clever. Inserting triplet stimulant combinations into the sequence. We just need to increase the power draw. No! Useless, isolated cow! Oof! Is it? Uh, aha! Uh, I just need to prize it open. Uh, let there be light. And then there was. Uh, this could complicate matters. Oh. 
One, three, six, two. Uh, well, that's rude, isn't it? One, three, six, two. Change the alarm codes, have we? Well, how about these alarm codes? <laughs> Wonderful! Perfect! <laughs> It's about time we increased oxygen flow into the burner. But don't you? After all, that little fiasco won't have gone unnoticed. Oh, and I almost forgot to connect the feeder colonies. You remember those, don't you, my little raptor? left. Ah! Increasing the acid discharge stream. Quickly now. We don't have much time. Perhaps more vents will help to heighten the urgency. Peace! Well, there's no going back now. Programming in the final sequence. Oh, it comes with scorpions. I'd love to stay and observe, but I need to go and buy us a little more time. Good thing I brought my diamond. I'll put a little bit here, a little bit there. Here, there, here, there, spread it all about.
the door frame connected to the uh, fuse bit. The fuse bit connected to the wire bits. Yes, the wire bit connected to my foot bone. Uh, oh, oh, that can't be right. Fire in the hole! Get back! <laughs> ah, my little ants, look at you. Perfected. Oh, this is the end, I'm afraid. After all, we can't have those brainless parasites unraveling all of your secrets, can we? So, I hope you understand. It's not personal. There's just one final step. <sighs> A once lethal catalyst for unbounded mutation, now tamed and molded through you, my raptor host, and finally rectified for human consumption. Tonight, I imbibe the power of the colony. <laughs> ah, yes, I can feel it. It's working. <laughs> <laughs> I say, oh, now this shouldn't be happening. Oh. The power of the colony, the bonds of the colony. No, yes. Oh, 
We're making our way through to the lab now. We must leave now, my queen. It is not safe here. We will go into the wild and feed so that you may birth the first elates. Securing the line of the Areptor will need much sustenance. Dear Lord, what is that? <laughs> 